Hi guys, this is Rich with Wild Wonderful Weekends, and I'm getting ready to get my kayak on the water for the 2022 Elk River Summer Float. It's the first time I've participated in this event, but I've heard a lot of good things. The put-in is at the foot of the Sutton Dam where you can register and drop your gear at the day use area. Next, you can drop your car off at the takeout at the RV campground and catch a free shuttle back to the put-in site. The float is about five miles with a nice mix of slow moving water and faster moving shoals. Shuttles run from roughly 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. and there was virtually no wait. There was no official commencement or if there was, I missed it. People just made their way down to the riverbank at their own pace which I thought was cool because it kept people from being too bunched up or having to wait for things to get underway. I'm finally on the water and moving down river. The weather was just about perfect for this kind of event. Not too hot and some cloud cover. Everything was going great and then in the very first set of small white caps, I got sideways trying to stay clear of a downed tree and ran into another boat. He was cool though, and nobody went into the water. We talked about kayaks for a minute, and then it was on with the float. By the second set of shoals, I had my bearings. Then in the next calm stretch of water, I had the privilege of spotting one of cryptozoology's greatest Hall of Famers, none other than Sasquatch himself. He was just doing what Sasquatches do and seemed to be digging the attention from the paddlers. Oh, you're fine. <laughs> Going down river, there were plenty of shady places. and places to stop and stretch your legs.
but one of the things I appreciated most was that the good people of Shiloh Fellowship were standing at the edge of the water, inviting paddlers to stop for free hot dogs, snacks, and water. Oh, yeah? Chili was homemade. You could just beach your kayak and go enjoy your lunch at their covered picnic shelter. After a lunch break, I was back on the water. There was more calm water to enjoy. And also some faster water as well. This float was a lot of fun and I definitely plan to do it again next year. If you haven't taken the opportunity to make this run, you certainly should. The river's a lot of fun. The scenery is beautiful. The event's well organized and easy to participate in. The people are friendly. And it isn't every day you can say you saw Bigfoot. Thanks so much for watching, and if you enjoy these videos, please like and subscribe. Take care.